In the past, Alfa Romeo had an extensive lineup that included various models, one of which was a four-door saloon named the 75, 1985-1992. Interestingly, in North America, this compact executive car was known as the Milano. Beyond the potential humor associated with the ship of the same name in Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy, it is noteworthy that Alfa Romeo's 75, also known as the Milano, marked the final model released by Alfa Romeo before its acquisition by Fiat. Now, Guided by its multinational parent company Stellantis, Alfa Romeo is reintroducing the Milano nameplate as a sport urban vehicle or a subcompact crossover SUV. Regrettably, due to its basis on the STLA small vehicle architecture and substantial shared elements with other models like the Fiat 600, Jeep Avenger, Peugeot 2008, Opel Maca, and the DS3 Crossback, it is logical that the Milano will not be available in the United States. Initially previewed in front of the Milan Cathedral, the Milano is set to debut next year, offering front-wheel drive, FWD or all-wheel drive, AWD electric options, along with a rumored three-cylinder turbo gasoline engine, at least during the initial production years. This move positions Alfa Romeo as a more conventional car brand. Featuring models such as the Milano, Tonale, Giulia, Stelvio, and concluding with the limited edition 33 Stradale supercar. Available in both internal combustion engine, ICE, and electric vehicle, EV, formats. While officially teased recently, the Milano's design details have also leaked sparking considerable interest and speculation from various sources, including digital car content creators. The forthcoming Milano is Alfa Romeo's first all-electric car, serving as the smallest member in its current lineup, which includes the Giulia, Stelvio, and Tonale. The company plans to unveil the Milano on April 10, 2024, during its final testing phase, with an emphasis on delivering a unique driving experience and precise steering geometry. The car is expected to compete with other sporty urban cars in its segment. The CEO of Alfa Romeo, Jean-Philippe Imperato, describes the Milano as a crucial step in the brand's transition to electric vehicles and emphasizes its role in strengthening Alfa Romeo's global presence. As part of this transition, Alfa Romeo plans to launch exclusively electric vehicles starting in 2025 and sell only electric cars starting in 2027. While details about the Milano remain mostly undisclosed, the company has confirmed that it will be available in an all-electric version, with the possibility of gas and or hybrid variants. The unveiling is scheduled for April 2024, with sales commencing in September. The Milano's entry into the U.S. market is uncertain, and the focus initially seems to be on the European market. Artists have created speculative illustrations based on leaked material, suggesting a distinctive design for the Milano, including an angular Scudetto grille, LED headlights, and unique rear features. The car is expected to maintain its distinct exterior components, with minimal shared elements from other models. In addition, Alfa Romeo highlights its improving quality record in the U.S. market, citing increased rankings in J.D. Power, improved service management, reduced warranty costs, and global sales growth. Despite the positive developments, it remains to be seen whether the Milano will make its way to the U.S. market, with the focus initially on Europe.